Well, thank you, Ken. As you can see, I'm by the interchange on the outskirts of town. We've got some gridlock going on, bumper to bumper traffic, but what a beautiful day to be stuck in that gridlock. Pristine skies ahead. Not a rain cloud in sight. Visibility so clear, in fact. You can even see Susan write me that check for the money she owes. You're going to fucking pay me. For a look at what's coming up, though, we're going to have to go to the map for the extended forecast. From up north, we've got a cold front moving on down. $42,000 COPA violations for content creators to make child-centric entertainment. So vaguely defined that that could encompass any video game video that might be uploaded on the platform. Nipply weather for any content creators that try to monetize videos for Let's Plays. Down south, we have a warm front moving in as well. Terms of service changes showing that your account can now be deleted if you're deemed not commercially viable. When those two fronts meet up in the middle, well, that's a big old pile of shit. Big old pile of shit. But you want to look on the bright side. Find the silver lining in things. The silver lining today looks like that traffic's cleared up. Cars are moving on out as the interchange now has normal drive times. Oh my god, Ken. Ken Studio, can you hear me? There's a driver veering all over the road. I don't I don't know what he's doing. Oh my god, look at the speed that he's going. He's got to give it. It's 100 miles an hour. Oh my god, look at the size of those flames. I can smell the bodies burning, Ken. It smells like cooking pig out here, Ken. One of the survivors, they're, they're coming over towards me. Sir, sir, are you okay? Oh my god, uh, the, his skin is just falling off his body. There's smoke everywhere, and he's dead. I don't think he's going to make it. You might not know this, but I studied criminal law before becoming a weatherman. My investigative abilities are telling me that I can determine the cause of death. Sadly, it looks like it was not the accident that did this fine gentleman in. But his YouTube account being hacked three days ago and YouTube support not doing a fucking thing to help him. In his pockets, I'm, I can see something. Try to pull it out, Ken. Let's, can we zoom the camera in? They look like tweets from other major content creators with accounts ranging from 100,000 to millions of subscribers begging YouTube to get off their lazy asses and do something. As a hacker's live stream a cryptocurrency scam towards his own subscribers, and they're, they're completely unaware, Ken. Even though YouTube is fully aware this is now happening right now on a 360,000 360, sub account. What a way to go. What a tragic way to go. Almost as tragic. It's not paying people what you fucking owe them, Susan.